What a disgrace. What a disgrace and what a damning indictment on our society that we have to be here this morning in the year 2008 to rally to support a union official, a union official who has done nothing but protect the interests of his members, what he's paid to do, what he's pledged to do. We've had to defend him from going to jail under a Labor government after the Australian people in November voted and sent a clear message that John Howard's workplace relations laws, lock, stock and barrel, should be thrown out of the window. What a disgrace. And John Howard determined many years ago that if he can break the back of the MUA, and he failed in that, then he'll try with the construction unions and then he'll move on from there. And we have demonstrated that we're not going to cop it and we're not going to sit down and let them do what they've tried to do. I don't mind the fact that our members occasionally use expletives in the workplace. I don't mind the fact that they think it's right to stand together, to bind together and exercise their fundamental human right to be a part of the union and to take action when injustice occurs. I think it's a fundamental human right that our society has been built on for over 150 years. The only political party that thought it was wrong was the Liberal Party. And now we're seeing extended. I'm proud to stand here on behalf of the Australian Workers' Union and say that we stand in absolute solidarity with our comrade Noel Washington and the CFMEU. And we will act out and take whatever action is necessary to ensure that these rotten laws are thrown out and that Noel Washington is free from persecution. Thanks for being here today. All the best. <laughs>